The P-51 Mustang is a single-seat, single-engine fighter aircraft designed and manufactured by North American Aviation for the British Royal Air Force and later adopted by the United States Army Air Forces. First seen combat over Europe near the end of 1943, the P-51 is usually recognized as the best all-around piston-engined fighter manufactured in considerable numbers during World War II. Therefore, it became the darling of the Army Air Forces and was described as the most aerodynamically perfect pursuit plane in existence by the Senate War Investigating Committee, which was initiated by late U.S. President Harry Truman in 1944. So, why is the P-51 Mustang so special and has become the most iconic aircraft of the Second World War? There are several points that make this fighter aircraft so outstanding and successful in the deadly skies of World War II. First and foremost, the P-51 Mustang was the first aircraft to apply a novel aerodynamic theory known as laminar flow on the wing design at that time. In contrast to turbulent flow, this effect allows for lower wing drag of 25% to 50%. It also included building the majority of the plane, such as its semi-monocoque fuselage and the laminar flow wing with aluminum, which led to greater fuel capacity and mission range. It is also noteworthy that the P-51's cooling system, which included an underbelly scoop that decreased drag on the fuselage and wing, was a unique design element. Further upgrades to this radiator cooling assembly resulted in the plane employing the Meredith effect, in which hot air from the cooling system left the radiator with a little amount of jet thrust that gradually increased the plane's speed. Besides that, the updated P-51 was powered by an outstanding V-12 Packard V-1657 Rolls-Royce Merlin engine, making it capable of flying at top speed of 437 to 440 miles per hour and reaching an operating ceiling of over 42,000 feet, well beyond what the Allison engine could have done. Lastly, what makes the P-51 Mustang so special was its deployment as a reconnaissance aircraft. It was built to hunt and kill by being armed with six wing-mounted 12.7mm M2 Browning machine guns. Even better for the P-51D version, particularly the hard points beneath each wing allowed it to be outfitted with 500-pound bombs or three-shot 114mm rocket launchers, enhancing its capabilities as a close air support platform. Therefore, the P-51 Mustang was entrusted with long-range reconnaissance missions over Germany in less than a year after it was introduced to frontline duty, with nearly 5,000 German planes shot down. It was also tasked with providing cover and protection for bomber operations by excelling its mission as the bane of the Luftwaffe and other Axis air forces with its fierce kill-to-loss ratio of 19 kills for every one Mustang lost. That's all for today. Thanks for watching and see you next time.